Hey everyone, Marth110 here, back with more Dream Team. Huh, I'm doing this a lot more often. As I should be. Whoops, sorry about that. Gotta turn the, uh, turn the volume down there, my bad. Um, but yes, I am recording almost, th it's 5 to 3 p.m. December 18th at this moment in time. Or December, December, I don't know. And I saw the Nintendo Direct today. Okay, so about freaking a minute later, let's actually start playing the game. Um, oh, we know what to do here. Oh, wait, what? I, I, I don't know what happened there. I don't get it. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how I messed that up. I guess I, I guess I forgot. Then you know what? I'm just gonna flee. I really don't want to waste, waste too much time here. Okay, so, I remember I skipped a pillow back here. Like, I just wanted to get Mario's level up over and done with, so, I walked by this. Or, you know what I mean. Okay. Alright, there we go. Now, I, I won't change the volume. For the rest of the video, it'll stay this way. But yeah, the Nintendo Direct that they show today, holy shit. Oh my god. Ugh, you know what? I'm so, so stunned. I think I need to just go on the page that says it all. Like, I, I just need to. Just to have it right in front of my face handy to just talk about it. Oh my god, there's Mario Kart. Okay. Let's see. So, the first game I'm going to be talking about, as my girlfriend Facebooks me a lot, hopefully I won't get too distracted. Um, alright, I think, yeah, this is a new enemy right here, so, I guess I'll post the stats for, the, for, for that. Nice. The first game that they showed in the direct was a game called Hyrule Warriors. Now, I never, like, I don't think at least, I don't remember playing Dynasty Warriors. Shit. I don't know, I've never, like, I, I don't really know anything about Dynasty Warriors. I don't know how many games are in the series. I don't know if if it is a series, like, if it, maybe there's only one game. Oh, I'm not going to be able to get any any of those done. Um, but, basically, it's The Legend of Zelda themed. And, even me not knowing what Dynasty Warriors is, like, I've, I've heard of it. It, it. it does sound familiar to me. Um, but, despite me not knowing what the hell it is, I'm getting that game. And, like, I don't know if it's meant to be, like, an eShop kind of title or, like, a fully-fledged game. I'm not sure what Dynasty Warriors is. Maybe people in the comments can tell me or, you know, tell me what it is exactly. If it's an actual series or what. Maybe there's only one game involved. I don't know. That's why I said I have no idea. Get away from me, please. You know what? Fuck it. Um. What are you even called? I, I forget what these enemies are even called. Okay, I just said that twice in a row. Okay. Um, let's just talk about this game for a bit. Basically, you have to remember which two are about to attack, and then they separate in groups, and, you know, whatever group they end up in, that's how you know where they attack from. And that's basically how you, how you, um, telegraph these enemies. It's pretty easy stuff. Let's get another Luigi-nary ball going on here. And, I don't know if any, if any other people out there agree with me or not, but I feel that this move 
is one of the best bro moves in the entire game. Like, it beats, um, it beats the Tower of Luigi's. Whatever that move is called. I forget. It's just, I don't know. Actually, I'm gonna look at, I'm gonna look at that right now. Whoops. Um, died? Attacks. Um, yeah, Luigi Nary Stack. To be honest, Luigi Nary Stack kinda sucks. And it costs four more BP than Luigi Nary Ball. Like, I mean, if you get an expert on it, it can do quite a bit of damage. Which isn't so bad, but like... With, with Luigi Nary Ball, it, you just kick that shit. And it pretty much kills everything. And plus, if you can't jump on a certain enemy, then you know you won't you won't be able to do damage, which is it, it's kind of rubbish. Nice. I saved over a third of the amount of pillows. Huh. Getting quite a bit done, actually. It's pretty awesome. Alright. Now we got this taken care of. Heavens! To be petrified in such a... I... I'm embarrassed to not know how to pronounce this word. Perlius. Peril Perilous, damn it! I knew that sounded fucking wrong. A perilous place. Phew. Or, phew, that was close. I might have fallen in the sea. Hmm. You two were the ones who saved me, right? Thank you so much. Damn. I just... I love all the races that Nintendo's coming up with, like, in these games. I just love it so much. Whenever Mario games do something, like, they differ from the norm, I just... I love it so much. I, I love it. It's... So awesome! Just... The feeling of Mario games getting stagnant, it's... It, it doesn't feel as stagnant as it did. I mean, New Super Mario Bros. 2, I just... I'll be straight up with you. I kind of hated that game. Like, I love the original. I love... NSMB Wii. I love... New Super Mario Bros. U and... Heck, New Super Luigi U. That's actually a pretty good one, too. Because it's definitely new. It, it has that new feeling. It's different, right? Oh, shit. But like, with NSMB2, it there's nothing new about it. I mean, yeah, you get a bunch of coins, but if the gimmick doesn't do anything, then it's pointless. Not to mention you get so many lives. It's it's just ridiculous. I mean, some people are probably thinking, well, you get a lot of lives in Mario games anyway, like, what's the point? Well, I want to feel like, if I want to do the infinite one-up trick, that's on my own accord. But with New Super Mario Bros. 2's case, you just play the fucking game normally and you get dozens of lives. Like, within, like, a few minutes. At least, if I want to get a bunch of lives, it's on my own accord, not just playing the game normally. It's just, it's annoying. Hey! Did you just guys hear someone? Oh, I gotta drink water to say these voices. Right here. What are you doing back there? I'm just a researcher, here to study the ruins. But some monster is in charge of my work. Oh, y you were hiding. Well, duh. <laughs> Anyhow, I'm so happy someone came here. Want to hear about my fascinating findings? Well, it might help us find Big Massive. Alright, everyone. 
Please take a look at the gate to your left. <laughs> he already sounds like an instructor. This gate has a mechanism of ancient pilo design. Does anyone notice anything unusual about the gate? Eh. <gasps> yeah, indeed. No keyholes or switches to be seen, you say. Quite right. The key is just behind you, folks. Huh? What are these panels for? I believe I found the answer written on the wall of the ruins. <laughs> Look, Mario's talking. <laughs> I don't know. The awakening gate opens when you when match symbols unite. Match symbols united? Oh, ah, I think I get it. Look at this panel. Maybe you need to move it to match the symbols. That is 100% correct. Gold star for you. <laughs> Even though she already has a star on her head. That's funny. Why don't I move the panels and open up the gate? Oh, another mystery for the ages. Well, actually, no, that's a lie. I, I just can't lift these panels up to move them. If we can't lift it up, then perhaps we can... Oh. Oh god. <laughs> Push it up from below! <laughs> You're on fire today, Luigi! I'm sure you two can do it. Give it a try! I have a feeling you're pretty close to solving this mystery. I'll stay here rumin or ruminating on my own for the time being. Oh god, rum. Hey, and it switched to hammer by itself. That's, I, can, I, I guess, convenient. I don't know. It's just a button press. Oh god. I hate rum. I hate it so much. The aftertaste. That's all I'm gonna say about it. And there it is. Whoa! Huh. Another mystery of the island solved! I must write to my learned peers. Learned peers? That sounds... weird. Okay, um, let's talk about the next thing. Wow, I've, I've actually... I've actually sustained commentary without talking about a second thing from Nintendo Direct. It's freaking awesome. Um, the next thing they talked about was... Or, yeah. Was some updates? No. But yeah, the next thing they talked about had to do with Kirby Triple Deluxe. And, oh my god. I am so freaking happy about what I found out about that game. It's nothing about the game itself. Let's just say it's about the release date. Okay. Here's the thing. The release date for the game at this point is only known in Japan. And that Japanese date is January 11th, 2014. Ow. And now you're probably thinking to yourself, well... Okay, you don't know any other dates? Why, like, why does that excite you? Do remember, I own a Nintendo 3DS LL. <laughs> you know what that means, right? It's a Japanese import. Yeah, I think people by now know that I have that system. It's a Japanese XL. And it's Pikachu. Another incentive. So, when it comes out January 11th, I'm gonna be able to download that shit if I if I want to. It's mine. But to be honest though, I actually want to get the box version. And that's it. I I'm not gonna get it when it comes out in North America for me. Honestly, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna get the box Japanese version. And um okay, you know what? I don't wanna fight you right now. Ugh. I always think it's gonna get me at the last second, right when I shrink Mario. And there's that. It all links up. Oh, Joe, go, go. 
Okay, is there anything? You know what? I'm just gonna say that there's nothing else over there, so I can just not encounter that enemy. That's it. That's all, guys. That's just, that's my plan. I better not fall down. Hello. I was just wandering around lost and wound up here. I wound up here. Heck of a view though, right? I think I'll chill up here for a bit. Oh, by the way, a friend of mine went up along that walkway. He hasn't come back yet, and it's been a bit. If you see him, let him know I'm looking for him, okay? Alright. Just wanted to see what that was about before I go into this pillow here. But yeah. That's the only date known right now for Kirby's, or, I guess it's not really plural, except for Return to Dreamland, that's what I'm thinking. Um, you know, like, Kirby Air Ride, Kirby Squeak Squad, stuff like that. You know, Kirby 64, the Crystal Shards. I always thought that game was called Kirby's Crystal Shards for, like, years, which is very strange. I love that game, though, so much. Um... But yeah, the release date for that is only known in Japan at this moment in time. Kirby Triple Deluxe. Oh god, another new type of enemy. I'll fight him after. I guess I'll just do this dream world and then I'll stop for now. Because I've been trying to do videos with less video time, if I said that right. Hmm. <laughs> Haven't done that move in a long time since Mushroom Park. So, I'm really freaking excited about that. I'm going to be able to get the game early. How much early, though? I'm not quite sure. Doom, doom, bam. Let's see, though. I don't know, like... If it's one of those cases where Triple Deluxe comes out in March or April or something, I'm going to be really, pardon my language, fucking happy to have this in, on January 11th. And I don't care, I'll get the boxed version. It'll take a bit to come out, like, whereas if I just download the, down, like, the digital version, I can just have it, like, like, right there. But you know what? I think I'm going to wait a couple days to get the boxed version. Eh. I'm not going to be waiting until the North American date anyway, so I might as well. Who cares if I miss out a couple days of January 11th? If it's not going to come out till March or April anyway, I'm, I'm already grateful. Or, already grateful. I... I am back to normal. <laughs> I have longed for this day. Within my petrified state, I heard the din of voices. Ever did I wish to know what was going on. Now I am free to see what happenings are in town. Many thanks for your help, mustache ones. Well, apparently it's changed dramatically. I think that's what Dreambird said at one point. And now that we're able to go up here... Ugh! I'm not gonna fight. You can vote for Luigi's. Oh, that's how you do it. You can vote for Luigi's level up in this part right now if you like. Give me some recommendations. And yes, I will show his stats at the end of the video, so I do not forget. Okay, one more fight and Luigi will level up, so... I'm gonna keep on running. Great, now I'm thinking about that song. By the Black Eyed Peas. Ooh, Counter Bell, not bad. Number eight. And, um... Yoshi's New Island. God. She keeps on, like, messaging me. Like, there's so much to catch up on. Um, honestly, I can't wait for that game. It's, you know, it's gonna be... It's gonna be really good. Um, apparently, there aren't a lot of people that liked Yoshi's Island DS. I actually liked the game a lot. I understand why people don't really like it that much, though, because... You know, Yoshi's Island, right? How how critically acclaimed is that game? Jeez. Yoshi's Island, man. It it just flat out set the bar. It 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 did. Um but this one isn't going to be made by the same the same company. So 
it's gonna be it's gonna be better than Yoshi's, Yoshi's Island DS, I think. Not to mention better hardware. Huh, you both dropped down. I guess that's it. I'll just turn into dust in this foreign land. Huh? I'm a grown toad and I still get lost. So lost that I end up in a place like that. Hey, who's back there, huh? Looks like somebody's sleeping in the background. Huh, wonder who that could be. I was so psyched to see you guys up there. I was gonna ask you to pull me up uh, out of here, but you guys just jumped on down, didn't you? Oh gosh, how are we gonna ever get out of here? Mr. Mario, Mr. Luigi, do something! Um, okay. Big red button. What if there were green buttons and Luigi would hit them with his hammer? I don't know, I've just thought about that. Whoa, that works! Oh, you guys are just the best. The best! Nintendo in a nutshell. Now I can go back whenever I want. I guess I'll hang here voluntarily now. That's actually hilarious. I don't know. Just the feeling of being voluntary, or doing something voluntarily, is just, I don't know, it's funny. Um... How long have we been recording? Yeah. It's actually a good time to stop now. So, I'll save the game. In this video, you can um, recommend me what you want for Luigi's level up. And don't worry about it. If one gets chosen over the other, I can just use beans to compensate for another recommendation that didn't get an initially picked. So, that's my plan. So, um, just to read this a bit better, I'll just do that. Oh, I have no syrup jars. Oh, whatever. I'll just use candies. Okay, so, there you go. On the top screen, there's, uh, there's Luigi's, um, statistics. Give me some recommendations on what you want to level up. See you guys later. I'll talk about more Nintendo Direct next time.